TV coming at you with another video. I don't think I've said that all Vlogmas, all of Vlogmas at all. Um, today we went to Aldi. And normally at Aldi we spend about $70 for about two weeks. And uh, today we spent $93. Um, we're hoping that this lasts us to the end of the year until um, January 4th. <laughs> Hey, what's up? Um, so if you're into dance content, uh, wedding videos, and um, just all kinds of lifestyle fun, and possibly uh, a girl who has ADHD and literally comes up with a new business idea um, every two months and then decides to do it, you might want to stick around. <laughs> Make sure you hit that subscribe button because I've got lots of small business venture content coming very soon because I am starting my own business and I decided to like two hours ago. So just support my dreams, okay? Okay, thank you. Thank you. Back to the video. Oh, we have a carton of eggs, which costs, I don't have the receipt, 89 but... 89 cents. 89 cents, okay. Now this is for two people, roughly, uh, and we will probably have to stock up back on milk and bread, but we got the whole wheat... Um, Logan Fresh Bread. I'm gonna put. Usually we get honey wheat, but we didn't have any, so we had to get that kind. We've got shredded wheat cereal. I do believe this was like a dollar fifty. Now I'm not gonna keep going through the prices just because it's. I don't remember the prices of everything, and I don't know where the receipt is. But just know that the total was like ninety-three something dollars. I think we also got these storage bags that we keep right here in our junk drawer. Every southerner has. I feel like other people who aren't southern have it too, but I feel like it's mostly a southern thing. We got a bag of white rice, a box of saltines. We'd love to eat our saltines with our soups and casseroles and um, all kinds of like, peanut butter and banana. And then <laughs> this bag of apples was $7. Uh, we will not be purchasing them again, but they are absolutely the most delicious apples I've ever tasted in my entire life. So I bit the bullet this time and bought the $7 apples. And then we've got chicken broth, which we'd like to put in our ramen, which we didn't get ramen this time because they didn't have any available the kind that I like. So we'll probably go back or he'll get some at Kroger when he goes to work. And then we got some, they were, what were they labeled as? They were just labeled as Indian sauces um, on the box. But we got some korma and some butter chicken sauce for um, just to eat with, you know. I was like, I've always wanted to try them, so I'm really excited. We got these tomato soup, two cans of tomato soup, whole potatoes, which we sometimes make soup out of. And a jar of peanut butter. Italian dressing, as well as taco seasoning mix. And then two cans of pickled beets like I like. And then we've got uh, two bags of frozen fruit that I use for smoothies. And then some celery. This, I will say, was only 95 cents. It was, this is a fat stack, a 10 piece a 10 count of tortillas. So that's a really good, that's a really good deal in my opinion. And then we got some taco shells. These were like 89 cents. And pancake mix. And then we eat a lot of tuna, so we have two cans of that. Also like jam on our toast, so I got some strawberry preserves, as well as some refried beans. And that is all the first bag. I got a Red Bull, but I drank it already, so just so you know. And then we got some Colby Jack cheese, um, a carton of milk, and some of this stuff we already have. It was, we just wanted to restock and get it anyway. Like, we have an entire thing of turkey down there for sandwich meat, but I was like, it wouldn't hurt to get another one. Um, so we'll be eating off this for a while. And then Aldi has these three pizza packs that we absolutely adore. 
And so we always get these. These are all staples. Um, this is always a staple. We always get the three pack. And then we got one of these calzones. It was $2 and we were like, we, I want to try that. So we just got one just to see if we like it. If we do, we'll probably get more next time. But the turkey and the fruit went along with the bread and um, peanut butter are staples in our grocery list as well as frozen green beans, frozen corn, and sweet peas. Now we already had chicken in the freezer. We already have a whole bag of chicken that we didn't eat from the last time we went uh, grocery shopping. So instead we got a bag of Alaskan cod. And cod is pretty much the only fish that I'll eat, so that's why we get that kind. And then we've also got some ground turkey because we'll make burgers or you know use them in uh, like tacos and stuff. And then we've also got Brussels sprouts, which I kind of want to like saute and like sort of kind of fry them because I hate Brussels sprouts, but I just wanted to try new things because it's always important. And then we got one singular pomegranate because it was like 29 cents for one. Um, and I like pomegranates. And then we got some cream cheese and a half duck that we want to try out. I'm not a big meat eater, but I did want to get this just to see what it would be like. Yeah, I know. Did you get butter? Oh, we needed butter. Didn't get we didn't need butter? Yes. I yeah. said we did need butter. I'm sorry. They're fine. what I used for the cookies because that's what it called for. That's why I didn't say we were And the last thing we got was this Vista Bay hard seltzer advent calendar. Now, how many days does this have on it? 25. <gasps> Are you kidding me? But it's season in different places. One, two. Yeah, three, I just thought it was 12. No. That's so cool. As I said, we got five days to catch it. Okay, so there's only that means there's only one for each day. Okay. See, I was thinking uh, there was two for each day. That's still not bad. Not Technically, we can wait to the 12th and then start, and then you'll I'll open. We'll just open two at a time. So this was originally thirty dollars, and we got it for fifteen. Um, and it's got different kinds of hard seltzers. I wanted an advent calendar this year, so I thought um, we agreed that the uh, alcohol one would be the best purchase, the best decision. But we're gonna wait. We're gonna wait until um, later on to start opening these. I might not wait till the 12th, because um, that's a whole week from when I'm filming this, and I don't want to wait till then. So we may start early where should we put this where should this go jet i don't know it'd be in a nice outstanding place let's see oh darn it what? it doesn't fit where i want it to go well that sucks okay well thank you so much for watching this um little grocery haul i really enjoyed it i put my uh my light in the kitchen because it's dark as heck outside and it gets dark super quickly it's only 5 30 you can't see that it's only 5 30 you still can't see that not really hi bar um but yeah i am going to start editing another vlog i think and then i will see you in my next one peace out girl scout and happy vlogs